I met Kristen on the weekend right after she was ordained. Lori and I were guests of Don and Carol Ann Brown at All Souls that weekend. Little did I know what was about to unfold for all of us. About a year later, I was called to be the interim rector at All Souls, or as you all corrected me, All Souls. It was the most fun I have ever had in my ministry or really in my working life. And Kristen was a huge part of that year for me. And she was with her pastoral sensitivity, her competence, and her backbone. She was the perfect colleague for me. Well, here's something you may not know. She performed not one, but two miracles. And you better notify the Vatican about this because she is a candidate for canonization. Let me tell you about her miracles. One Sunday, I was at the altar consecrating the bread and wine of our Holy Eucharist. And I looked down and there wasn't wine in the chalice, there was water. Well, I stepped away to serve the bread to the acolytes in the choir, and when I came back, it was a miracle. There was wine in the chalice. Now, someone told me later that Kristen had stepped away for a few moments into the sacristy to do something, but I never saw that. I am convinced that her holy hands converted that water into wine. And it happened not just once, but twice. It happened on another Sunday. It is a miracle. She is a miracle worker. Well, as you know, I journeyed on to be the rector of a church in Charlottesville, Virginia, which is south of Baltimore. And soon, Kristen will be joining us here on the East Coast. Well, I've told her she can be the associate here at my church anytime she wants the job. But she tells me that even she cannot perform the miracle of clearing the traffic between here and the Washington, D.C. and Baltimore megalopolis. Even she can't do that miracle. Well, please let me just finish by thanking all of you for all you've done for us and for all you do for so many. And Kristen, may much joy and many miracles follow you in this next chapter of your life and your ministry. God bless you and everyone.